Would you like to save your Captain Kirk? But you said that was impossible. We have many powers Zargon did not permit us to use. We felt them too tempting to us. This body pleases me. I intend to keep it. I see. And Hanok intends to keep Spock's body, of course. Hanok's plans are his own affair. I wish only to exist in peace as a living woman. If you're asking my approval, I require only your silence. Only you and I will know that Dr. Mulhall has not returned to her body. Isn't that worth your captain's life? Doctor, we can take what we wish. Neither you, this ship, nor all your worlds have the power to stop us. Neither Jim nor I can trade a body we don't own. It happens to belong to a young woman. Who you hardly know. Almost a stranger to you. I will not peddle flesh. I'm a physician. A physician? In contrast to what we are. You are a, a prancing, savage medicine man. You dare defy one you should be on your knees worshiping? you with a single thought. <laughs> Temptations within a living body are too great. Forgive me. I am pleased, my beloved. It is good you have found the truth yourself. Zaga. Where are you? I thought you destroyed by Henna. I have power even Henna does not suspect, beloved. Yes, I see, I, I understand. Just as we would have placed our consciousness within robots, Sargon has placed his into your vessel. Doctor. Doctor, leave us. Sargon has a plan. We have much work to do. 